Now, some of us are all about neutral spaces. Some of us just love minimalist spaces and maybe just contemporary or just want to go for Japandi. So we have warm tones throughout the space, mostly whites, a few browns here and there. Now, this is great. Great for you um, if that's the style that you love. But how do we ensure that we're not falling flat or bland with the style? Uh, what you want to do is that you are creating a bit of visual interest, so that you're creating a space that has depth as well. So today's video is all about learning the tips that you can use when styling neutral spaces to make them more interesting and of course more aesthetic. So guys, Fazati Ali here, interior designer, and today's video. Let's learn about the tips that will help us make interesting neutral spaces. With neutral spaces, a lot of times what we're working with in terms of color scheme are monochromatic colors. So this is a space where you have everything in a pretty much a similar color tone. So from maybe whites and only brown tones, and just nothing much going on. What you want to do to create interest in this kind of space is to play around with contrast. Now contrast adds some depth into a space. So if you have a space that's just having more of whites going on, bring in some black, just pop in that dark color in there and create some interest in the space. So be it in a kitchen where you mostly had woody cabinets going on and you know white worktops going on, then go ahead and bring in black faucets and fixtures on your handles and so on and you will definitely get to see that interest and depth created in the space. So it's a visual thing, but it actually allows you to pick up on, wow, this space, there's something about this space. You might not pick up exactly what it is, but it is a contrast that is being created by playing around with deep tones as well as light tones in terms of colors. So, so this is something to definitely incorporate into your space when you're playing around with color tones. Make sure you are playing around with both light shades and dark shades to create a proper amount of visual interest that will make your space look a lot more aesthetic. Now, number two on my list when it comes to making a neutral space feel more interesting is to go ahead and play around with texture and pattern. Now, of course, everything is pretty much in a similar color tone like we talked about. So how to make it more interesting is to bring in texture. Now, an amazing way to do this is to bring in natural materials such as jute, maybe have some proper wood furniture pieces, some nice stone um, finishes on your walls and so on to create a focal point play around with texture um so when it comes to your rugs bring in bold patterns so it's texture and pattern bring in some bold pattern it doesn't mean get a multicolored rug no you're working with neutral tones that's okay so just make sure your one tone carpet has a nice bold pattern that creates um some visual depth in the space grounds the space really well because as we all know the rug sits under most of our furniture pieces in a space. So yeah, this will be really great. So definitely think about adding texture and pattern into any space to make it look a lot more interesting. Now, something else to think about is playing with shapes as well. Now, when it comes to your furniture pieces, don't just have strong lines such as rectangles in your sofas and so on. Bring in different shapes. Have, you know, interesting silk hoods playing around in your, in your furniture pieces so that you're bringing in some nice curves. You have straight lines. You have unique organic, you know, shapes as well. Maybe when it comes to your mirrors and so on your coffee table this will look a lot better so you might think ah you know maybe shapes are not that big of a thing but when it comes to neutral spaces or actually any space to be honest feel free to always go for different shapes that will actually accentuate and create more interest in a particular room so do this with your space it will allow you to create more interest mostly because you are working with neutral colors only it will be a great way to add a bit more interest in this particular area when it comes to your chairs and mostly your accent chairs please right now we have beautiful contemporary pieces that have the most interesting shapes that will make your space just pop out so definitely think about this when styling a neutral space
a great way to add a subtle pop of color in any neutral space is to bring in greenery now of course plants are amazing ways to you know add some green in the space that will just look absolutely amazing green is a beautiful color it represents that feeling of freshness vibrance life and so on so feel free to bring in nice plants into the space have them in the corner of your room in different areas of the house it will work really amazingly and of course it will be a great way to style any space including a neutral room so please feel free to go out there and bring in nice planters and of course think about bouquets of flowers as well just have them sitting on your coffee table on your consoles in the corridors in the entryways and so on this will be an absolutely amazing way of just adding a feature in the house that will just create quite a lot of aesthetics Now go on and bring dramatic art or wall decor such as mirrors in a neutral space to add accessories and make a space that feels a lot more aesthetic. Now of course going out there and bringing in a large art piece is important when it comes to styling any space and more so a neutral space. And this can also be a way to add some color into the space. So you can either go for neutral um, artworks, the still works, but going for something that also has a bit of color, you know, something that can be your accent color in the space will also add more interest. So feel free to play around with beautiful pieces, go for large art pieces. I always, always, always recommend large art pieces because this stand out more, create a focal point and will look absolutely amazing. Go for something with some nice texture and this will just look really, really great. And you can also feel free to play around with mirrors. So bring in some mirrors in your living area, in your bedroom area and so on and of course because you're trying to really create something that pops in a space that is quite muted in terms of color go for you know interesting shapes in terms of mirrors go for something that has a nice organic shape a beautiful maybe wood frame and so on this will look absolutely amazing so when it comes to styling neutral areas feel free to also accessorize in the right way and you'll have a space that also pops in its own way So who is saying neutral spaces feel bland? I feel like you can definitely make a neutral space pop and look super amazing. So I hope this tip will help you style up that space of yours and it will look a lot more aesthetic and stand out. And of course, keep in mind that there are a lot more tips that you can use out there. If you have or know any other, do let me know in the comment section below. I would also love to learn from you. Anyway guys, thank you so so much for taking your time to watch this video. Feel free to like, comment, subscribe and share. I'll be truly, truly grateful. Anyway guys, see you next week inshallah with another video. Love you guys so much. Bye-bye.